Hey, so today we would be talking about using icons as a font in our web page or website. So icons are something that are used in almost any modern UI designing today. So we would be exploring how to use icons in a best way. So one way is like just using the SVG file of the icon in our web page or website. And the other way is to use this same icon as a font in the website. So for most of the times, we prefer font or some or any other third party library like this, which provides us some icons free of cost. So the advantage of using icons as font is that we can treat these icons just as a normal font in our web page. So this will provides us more control over the icons like changing their color, font size and much more. Time, let's say if we have our own custom icon and we have SVG of that icon and we wanted to convert them into a font. For example, we have this uh, cloud icon which we wanted to convert and use it as a font in our website. So for this, there are many third party services where we can upload our SVG icon and convert them into a font. So I will be demonstrating here how to convert a SVG icon into a font using one of the most popular service that is Fantastic. So first we will need to create account. Okay, so once we logged in, we will get this dashboard. So here, what you can do is that you can click here, add more icons. Just import the SVG file of your icon. So we had this, the cloud icon, we will click open. It will take some time to upload, then go. Now click here. So we have this new set and this icon is uploaded here. To convert this into a font, we need to publish this. So just select here by clicking on this icon and click publish. So here it's showing publish one icon. This is like uh, hosting your icon on a cloud and you can use from there. Or if you want to go for downloading this, you can just click here, download. So this will download a zip file. So I have extracted the zip file in a folder. Let's see. So we have this. So basically what you will get in this zip is that a folder of all your fonts. Basically these are the files that contains code for converting your SVG icon into a font. This is all provided for a demo purpose from the Fantastic itself. And you can play with this to get a uh, more idea about this font. So for example, if we inspect this, let's go here. So here basically those font files are imported and some, and some class are written to use those as a font. Okay. So let's see here. So we have this icon, just click on this. So to use any icon that we have downloaded, we just need to use their class that are defined in this CSS file. Okay. For example, we have this prefix icon that are defined in this CSS class. And all this class will start with icon. Although you can customize this, the prefix that we have over here is currently icon. You can customize this by importing the icons. Okay. So let's see how to use them. So to use icon, we just need to add this class to any element in HTML. So here they have added the class as icon. And here, just as a normal font, for example, if we give it a font size of 50 pixels, it will increase. Okay, so it's hiding because we have some wrapper around it. So it's hiding because we have some wrapper around it. So just remove this wrapper for a moment. 
So we have this. Yeah. Okay. Second that we can use just as a normal font. So if we have to change the color, we can change the color to red. Okay, so just uncheck this and yeah. So to use these icons in our website, what we will do is that we will copy this font folder in our repo and this CSS file. We will link this CSS file into the HTML file. And then we can just put this class icon in any HTML element and we can treat them as a font.